Hi, in this video we will see the SQL transform. So let's go to BODS tool. I have a job in the name SQL and a data flow created in it. I will drag in my SQL query. It's in platform SQL query. When you open it, you see some options here. Data store. I'll choose my data store as staging and database automatically takes everything. Join tag I don't want to use. I, want, I don't want to cache it. Since there's so much not much of data and the RFH size will be thousand. That's okay for me. Then let's write a query. In this I have a table in the name employee. So I'll select select star from, from employee. When I update it, I'll see every column of this table. I can show it to you in SSMS. So these are the columns that you see in here. Okay, SQL, this is how you write it. And I'll dump everything into a target table. I'll say, okay, this is SQL, so I'll say SQL right. The data store will be same. How much? There is no need of query if you directly want to dump everything into the target table. I'll execute. This is simple, like uh, simple SQL queries are written here. Like you write in SSMS. So total three five seven three records submit. Let's apply a join here. Where emp id that's column of this. In I have one more table which is a copy of this with uh, I think one or two extra rows in it and I'll again select select emp id okay emp id from emp employee underscore copy this is just a replica of it where this and this let's before executing let's see how many records exist in both the tables so this is it. We have 3573 and 3574. Now let's see how many are common. It's just a uh, validated. Okay. Well, as you can update. If there's anything wrong, it will throw an error. Let's execute. Three five seven two records will get because these many are common in both. Let's say, let's add one more filter here. And EMP ID is equals to 1001. Since the data is same in both the tables, this 1001 is present in both the tables, so we shall be getting only one record. is the error and okay in place of and I think I have written and okay okay now let's execute it one so it has worked what in case this value needs to be parameterized how do you pass it this is a this is a common uh, interview question what you had what they'll ask you can you pass a variable here the answer is yes okay let's uh, let's parameterize it so i'll go to sql job i'll create a variable and i'll add a script though you can direct hard code it in the window itself variable window but uh, i'll add it in a script i'll make a series join variables I'll add a global variable g underscore id though I can add the value here no need to uh, initiate here but I'll prefer this ok let me copy the name control c ok I'll assign that one double zero one to this column and build it. Type var care 
and okay it let's all change it to back here i don't want any conversions so back here four four then okay now i'll try to parameterize it see when we had added one the buzzer one it worked fine let's see what happens can you add it here let's give up it throws an error it says invalid pseudo column hash uh, dollar g underscore id is variable so for this thing you must do just a change okay what i'll do is i'll add 1001 as it is i validate or i this update it here then save it now i'll place it here variable remember you have to place it in a square brackets and go execute so before like applying the variable you must hard code it with the value that you want to pass okay it has accepted if you directly want if you directly copy paste the variable here it will throw an error the pseudo column error so this is how you can uh, take care of the variables you can pass the variables you can pass anything here you can have a date time uh, that's that is initiated in script and called here for that as well you must pass a value earlier then you can uh, replace it with the variable check it so you must be having one record with one example okay this is how sql works so there is not much of a difficulty here you can write a simple query here like in sms super minute clear thank you so much for watching please like and subscribe